Hey guys, it's me again, and today I did a different look. It's a rainbow, if you can see it. Um, I put the glitter on top of it to make it look really different. And I got a request from this from none other than the lovely Serena. And she wanted kind of a tropical, colorful look, so I just did a rainbow all the way around my eye. And I think everyone's really going to like this because it's not too crazy that you can wear it to the mall or something, but also it could be something that you use maybe to go out one night. So I hope you enjoy watching, and this is actually part one of two videos I'm going to make today because I always do my makeup before my hair, and right now my hair is wet, so I haven't combed it or anything. I just have bobby pins in my bangs right now, and next I'm going to do a hair tutorial on how to curl your hair. So keep watching, and if you want to know how to curl your hair, then watch my next tutorial also. Okay. So what I've done so far on this side is curled my eyelashes and applied moisturizer. So now I'm going to take a black eyeliner pencil, and this one's called Styly Style. It's the one I always use. It's waterproof, line and seal, 24, and I'm going to get this and put it on my inner rim. And it doesn't have to be super black. I guess it all depends on your preference. And I'm just going to put it right there. I'm not going to go all the way to my inner corner. I'm just going to kind of stop where my iris lines up with my bottom eyelid. Now I'm going to take a copper pencil. Um, this one's Urban Decay. It's called Lucky. But use any eyeliner that you have. Um, this is going to act as the orange. So I'm going to line my entire bottom lash line with this. But again, I'm not going to go all the way to my inner corner. I'm going to stop about right here, lined up with my iris. And now I'm going to take a blue eyeliner pencil. This one's called Electric, also by Urban Decay. I like these ones because they're waterproof and they never come off unless you wash it off. And I'm going to line my upper lash line starting from the inner corner all the way across. Then I'm going to do the bottom where I didn't put the orange copper eyeliner. And they're just going to kind of line up. They don't have to blend or anything. But after this dries for about four or five seconds, I'm going to go over it again. And that just gives it a really intense blue color because usually the first time it won't come out as bright. And on the very end, I'm going to extend it just a little. Okay, so this is what it's going to look like. It's just going to be kind of copper on the bottom, blue around. Next, I'm going to take a pink eyeshadow. I use Sting by Urban Decay because it's really bright. But again, I just want you to use any bright pink eyeshadow. Um, like I always say, I don't want you to feel like you have to go out and buy every product that I have. Just use whatever you have. And I'm going to take an eyeliner brush, slanted eyeliner brush, and get the pink on it. And I'm going to use this on the very outer corner, on the bottom and top. This is going to kind of be the red in my rainbow. But when you put it over the blue, it makes it turn purple. And when you put it over the orange, it looks more red. After I do that, I'm going to take a purple. This one's T-I-G-I, and I'm going to align the top half of my upper eyelid with this. So I'm just going to put it over the blue, and that'll turn it purple. Only the outer half, though. Then I'm going to take pink again, and with the pink, I'm just going to go over that a little. So now you can see the top is purple, and then under here is pink. Next, I'm going to take a bright yellow eyeshadow. I use one in this palette. It's Lancome. I don't know how old it is. And I'm going to get it on my eyeliner brush again. And I'm going to put it right here where the orange and the blue meet on the bottom. 
so I want you to be able to see this. I'm going to put it right here in the middle. And I'll kind of go out and blend it with both a little like that. And so now you have red, orange, yellow, and blue. So the last thing is green. And I'm just going to use my other Urban Decay eyeshadow. Um, you can find green eyeshadow anywhere. Green is really universal. So I'm going to take this bright green color and put it on my eyeliner brush again. And keep in mind that in between the uses of all of these colors on the same brush, I'm wiping the brush off. So, I have the green, and I'm going to put it on the lower and the very inner corner on the top. Alright, so now your rainbow is done on both eyes. And what I'm going to do next is put on mascara, Colossal, favorite one. And then I'll come back right after I put it on both eyes. Okay, I'm back. I put on my mascara and now I have to put on blush. I'm going to use Cargo. It's called Sunshine Coast. So I'm going to put this on from on top of my cheekbones to under them. Then I'm going to take a Stila bronzer, this one, and I'm going to put that on top of my cheekbones up here. So, after you've done that, you can decide to be finished with this look, or you can do one more thing that makes it look really fun and pretty, and you can add sparkles. So, this is the thing about glitter. If you have powder glitter, it can get everywhere, so you might want to do that before you put on your mascara. But the kind of glitter I have comes in a little tube. It's kind of like liquid eyeliner and has a small brush and then you apply it right on top of your eyeshadow. So how I'm going to do this, and this is just a suggestion, like the makeup looks really pretty if you don't use the glitter also. And I'm going to put it on top of the purple because this one is purple. Pearl colored. But it gives the blue really shimmery really really bright look and then on top of the green I'm going to use cream sparkles so there is another way to try this look and that's it so Serena I hope you like it and I hope you actually get to use it and I hope everyone else enjoyed watching this and maybe one day we'll all try it